If you're gonna be a real pirate, you should do something pirate-like. Like what? I hear there's a cave full of treasure somewhere nearby. I'd like to see that on a map. X marks somewhere nearby. Great. That treasure cave must be quite close by. So you say. It's too big a hoard to dig up alone. We can split it if you want to help. Mm, well, you are quite puny, so you will need help. Tell me, exactly where is this supposed treasure then? There's a small cave on the mountain opposite the watering hole. You're sure? Of course. It's at the very back. Mm, I suppose I could take a look. You should. No chance. You're coming with me. And you better not be spouting bullshit. Fine. You go first. Move it, you. So, now it's just the two of us. You set me up, you sneaky little shit! Enough already. Finally! Just sod off, okay? Just sod off, okay? You can take the water barrels to the quayside now. Butch won't give you any trouble. He won't? 
We'll get you your daughter. I mean, water. Then. No need to go. from the town, finally. Seriously, I thought we were done for. So what's the matter? It's my mate Duncan. We were out here fishing and then, oh, oh it was horrible. This thing, maybe a hobgoblin. It came out of nowhere, Duncan. I, I think it ate Duncan. Calm down and tell me what happened. Well. We found a good fishing spot in a grotto. We thought it was our lucky day, plenty to sell in the town. But then we heard this, this, this really horrible noise. Oh, something really pissed off and hungry. Me, I, I scarpered fast and I saw Duncan. It wasn't with me. This grotto, where is it? Not far, just down the end of the beach. I would take you, but you know, the, the hobgoblin. What makes you think it was a hobgoblin? It sounded like one. 
you know, from the stories you hear. A horrible evil spirit made unnatural flesh. That's exactly what it sounded like. You're an expert on these things. Fish, sea monsters, we fishermen have to know about everything lurking in these waters. You left him back there? I know. Please, can you help him? He's my mate. But what can I do against a creature like that? Don't worry, I'll try to sort this. You will? Oh, thank you, sir. Please, don't be long. I'll see if I can find your friend. He's probably had it. Poor bastard. Be good to know for sure, so I can take word back to that girl of his. Let's not give up hope yet. I need some fresh fish. I'm not doing anything with that monster out there. Sorry, but I don't want to die. Try that with me, there'll be trouble. How am I doing? You know what I think of you, don't you? That I'm great? Okay, you're great. Now move it.
on, let's both take it on. Where did you appear from? Outside? Glad you think it's funny. You must be either brave or just stupid to come here. Don't you know about the monster loose out there? Me, I just barely made it into here alive. So I see. You realize you'll have to leave here at some point? Well, at least you're here now. So what were you doing to end up here in the first place? I was just fishing in the grotto with my mate Eddie. Then that... that... Monster appears and Eddie runs off and leaves me. What a great friend. The thing still went after him, so I ran in here to hide. That thing, it was huge. You're lucky we found you, you know that? Things just get worse and worse here. This island used to be pretty safe. Used to be worse than you'd come across would be some drunken pirate on his way home from the pub. Now, though, there's all sorts of horrible things crawling out of the sea. I just don't understand why all this is happening now. It's safe to go now that thing's dead. Dead? Thank the Geiger! This is definitely the last time I go fishing in a shithole. Here, I owe you for saving me. I'll stick to fishing and leave the treasure hunting to the experts. Nothing here, nothing here with me. Nothing here for me. Your friend was worried about you, that's why we're here. Didn't see him being too worried when he ran off and left me. You know, when all this is over, me and him will probably have a laugh about it one day. But right now, if one of us is going to get eaten, I'd want it to be him. He does it.
Okay, scratch one hobgoblin. You sure it's dead? Well, unless there were two horrible growling things in that grotto, then yeah, I am sure. These are dark days. Strange, horrible things crawling out of the sea. I can't help thinking this is just the start of it, and there's worse things to come. Now there's a comforting thought. Relax, your friend Duncan's safe now. I can't believe it. I was sure he was done for. I can't thank you enough for saving him. I mean it, thank you. He was lucky, you both were. You don't have to tell me that. What about those fish barrels? No worries, I'll deliver them straight to the quayside. Let's see what we've got here.
What in the name of the pox is going on here? Can't stop, Admiral. We're about to sail. Cast off. Cast off! I've made it plain. All trade is strictly forbidden. That should be clear enough even to one as bollock-brained as you! Remind him of the creed. Listen, Admiral, your dispute's with Slane, not me. I don't care. No cargo leaves my harbor, and that's the end of it! Those things are mine now, Alvarez. I made a deal with each of your people. And like it says in the creed, a deal's a deal. Isn't that right? You presume to turn the words of the creed against me? You conniving ball bag! Slain has put you up to this! Go then! I cannot go against the creed. But remember this, Captain. If we fight each other, Mara has won. Mark my words, and beware of her henchmen! One more thing. Fire away, sport. How many barrels of fish do you need? A couple will do. I can get them from Eddie the Fisherman. Well, make sure you get the best stuff. I like a nice piece of mullet or snapper. Fresh water's on its way. Nice one, sport. That was my biggest worry. Get stuck at sea without water, you'll end up drinking your own piss. And that's just no fun at all. That's everything we need to put to sea. Then there's nothing to keep us here, sport. It'll be good to get out of this rat's nest. Just tell me when you're ready to go. We can now leave Antigua. Then get on that boat of yours. Tell your helmsman to put you ashore on the Isle of Thieves. Isle of Thieves? You'll see once you get there. All right, but you'd better not be far behind. Don't worry, sport. I'll be there. I'll see you on the Isle of Thieves. Both ships are fully stocked. Oh, you really are my hero. Slane says he wants to meet me on the Isle of Thieves. Hmm, I know where it is, but not much else about it. The name's not that encouraging. If you die, I guess we'll know it was a trap. <laughs> 